some of the solutions that i found super impactful in my training in the last 10 years with uh, working as a uh, an anti aging uh, concierge was that how to prevent the pause because the pause is terrible for a lot of other things but definitely terrible for your connection with your beauty and your connection with your sense of versions of self that you are fond of and um how to keep that energy uh, together so that your system does not disintegrate as you move further into time and how to stabilize it because like literally so many women spend literally 30 to 40% of their life in this syndrome with this syndrome living with this syndrome and they think that that's the new normal however that shouldn't be we have extended your life uh, life span without increase enhancing the quality in that life because then what's the point if you're going to be sleepless and you're going to be sick of yourself and hopping from one doctor to the other figuring out what what's the, uh, all this suffering about however the purpose is now the new purpose for humans is now to not, to establish like that at least 100 years of uh, a lifespan which is filled with energy and and a lot of potential because if you can con- if once women have taken care of their uh, reproductive function their functionality shouldn't just end at the at that point they will live for another 30 40 years and here is like this large swaths of population that is going to now exist but not in full potential and why should that be and that's i think that if we can fix this point in human uh, health span uh, especially for uh, women i think it will be good for everybody but i think that it's not just women we should fix it for men and women and i it will be there will be a lot i i see a lot of potential in this study so the things that i have devised in my office is one is that i have tried to learn and teach people about supplements and a lot of those supplements are oral some are intravenous and they should be you know so your routine visit to a doctor's office should be something that you know i feel that the way i do the infusions that something that we need to do for women in their perimenopause and we have to start doing giving them that energy and the second thing that i have found very very uh, helpful is some energy devices so there are certain energy devices that allow you to stay connected with versions of yourself have benefited a lot using them for myself and i think that uh, anybody uh, unfortunately many of these um, devices are and medications even though they are fda approved uh, and cleared are really not uh, covered by uh, health insurances yet so they become out of pocket costs so it's quite uh, difficult for people to gain access to these things uh, worldwide yet but i do see that at some point they will become like very routine trips to a doctor's office <music>